Researchers have developed a heart on a chip. Find out what it does on NSF Science now. Heart disease is the leading cause of death in the United States, killing over 700,000 annually, while one in three people dies from complications in the first weeks or months following a traumatic heart event. What if there was a way to better monitor the heart during these critical weeks and months? NSF-supported researchers at George Washington and Northwestern Universities have developed an experimental device that, when placed on the heart, could one day help monitor and treat heart disease and dysfunction, possibly saving lives. While the device is not meant to replace a pacemaker, it could provide temporary monitoring at critical life-threatening periods following surgery. Uh, specifically for patients that just went through cardiac surgery, they are highly likely to develop severe uh, life-threatening cardiac complications, so they need a temporary device can diagnose those medical conditions and provide treatment. The device is an advanced soft electronic system that performs complex heart examinations to give physicians real-time heart health information and deliver needs-based treatment. The system could also be used for short-term monitoring and control of other organ functions. Our device is capable to do monitoring and uh, uh, therapeutic treatment of various kinds of diseases. In addition to heart, we can apply that to different organs systems, such as the brain, use that for deep brain stimulations to treat neurological disorders, examples including Parkinson's disease. The system is unique because it is made of materials already approved by the FDA as compatible with the human body. It will fully dissolve within the body once monitoring is complete. So we can program the lifetime depending on the need, several days to several weeks. While more testing is needed, the device eliminates the need for surgical removal, thus lowering infection risks and easing patient financial burden, potentially saving lives.